More states are making sure that people who have had contact with Ebola victims are isolated. And here in central Kentucky, health officials want to have a plan ready to go. WKYT's Rebecca Smith has more on how health care facilities are preparing in case the Ebola virus does show up here. Baptist Health Richmond is equipped to isolate a suspected Ebola patient if need be. Today's meeting included representatives from that hospital and other area agencies going through the proper steps should a patient seek treatment who thinks they may have Ebola. The isolation room is located right across the hall from the nurse's station. This allows them to monitor the patient as needed, but at the same time, limit access. It's an exercise in protocol that pairs CDC recommendations with local EMS and hospital staff who are most often the first line of defense in dealing with an infectious disease outbreak. At Baptist Health Richmond, we work with, you know, we have um, six sister hospitals across the state that we work with um, who also work with the um, CDC and the Kentucky Department of Public Health. Baptist Health gave us a look at the equipment they use if they happen to have a case of suspected no. Ebola, things like masks and full body suits. William says one of the most effective methods of preparedness is having a plan. Hopefully in the coming weeks and months we will come back together and do a full scale act out drill um, in a similar fashion once everybody is um, comfortable with the process and procedures that are in place and that we've had a it's really a coordinated effort. In Richmond, Rebecca Smith, WKYT. And we checked this afternoon and according to the State Department of Health, there have been no confirmed cases of Ebola in Kentucky.